Hey YouTube, John here, and today We're talking about why helium makes your voice sound like this. Well the short answer would be because helium's a lot less dense than air. But to really understand this on a deeper level, we need to first understand what sound is and how our body normally produces it. As you may know, sound is caused by a series of vibrations in the air. In our bodies, these vibrations are produced by a structure called the larynx, aka our voice box. Our voice box contains our vocal cords, which are a pair of flaps in a roughly a V shape, which open and close hundreds of times per second to produce the vibrations that we hear as sound. But the vibrations produced by our vocal cords don't come in the form of a neat sine wave. Instead, they produce a mix of many frequencies, and it's up to our mouths to choose which ones are amplified. This is done by changing the shape of our mouth, and thus altering its resonance frequency. For example, an ah shape amplifies a higher frequency than an ooh shape would. But when helium's added to the equation, this amplification gets distorted. Though your vocal cords are still turning out vibrations at the same frequency that they were before, the vibrations move two and a half times faster through helium than they do through air. This changes the resonance frequency of your mouth and causes higher frequencies to be amplified. So actually, inhaling helium doesn't change the frequency, or pitch, of your voice at all. What it actually changes is the timbre, or the quality of the sound, which your mouth amplifies. And helium's an inert gas, so it won't harm you in any way as long as you breathe in enough oxygen between breaths of helium. So feel free to try this at home. And until next time, Never stop learning.